want there to be places that are part of our natural and cultural legacy. Um, I think it's the responsibility of current generations to do that. And I can't remember who's, whether it was Roosevelt or someone else, but that a society will be judged by, not by what it um, kind of takes, but what it passes on to future generations. And I think that's very true. Our job in the park service is to um, maintain those cultural and natural parts of history for not only the current generations, uh, but uh, you know, future generations. So they have the opportunity to experience it the way it was and the way it should be. Um, it's our responsibility, because if we hand over a world to your generation that is severely diminished, and it already is, I mean, there's species that you will never see that our grandparents saw. And that to me is a sad thing. And I think we should be doing our best to, to pass on places, as the Park Service mission says, unimpaired for future generations. Okay, the value of trees. Big question. I was out doing my first nature walk on this trail, and a fellow in the back of the group, I stopped at this giant Sitka spruce. It's one of the probably top 100 in the world. Massive tree. And he chimes up from the back of the group and says, Hey, Ranger, how much is that tree worth? And I didn't know. So I got a postcard back in those days. We didn't have email. And uh, I measured the tree. I measured its height. I talked to a friend down in Eugene who knows these kind of things. And he came back with a figure of $18,000. So I wrote that on the back of the postcard because he had put his address on it, chucked it in the mail, and thought it was good. Well, a few weeks later, I'm up on the Hollow Moss Trail. Same tree, three women. They asked me to take their picture. And I said, sure. And it was obvious to me as I grabbed the camera that I was looking at three generations. We had grandma, mom, daughter, right? And I said, three generations, that's a cool idea. And grandma pulls out of her purse a black and white photo of her mother. Same tree. So you ask them what the value is, and it was a lesson for me that here, this is sacred. This is a place where people can come and expect it not to change, at least not at human hands, and that you can kind of count on it. It's exclusive of all those other things, that stuff that we get so addicted to. And, and think is so important. This goes way beyond that.